I'm getting ready for another trip. So far, it was a great winter. We had tons of snow and it just kept coming. I try to spend a big part of the season at home. Of course, I love traveling, but there's nothing like a great session on your home mountain. I was guiding, riding with friends, and got to explore some new terrain, even by the lake, right here, outside my back door. But before the season's coming to an end, it's time to catch up with someone I don't see that often anymore. I actually haven't seen him since Asaya was born. Let me introduce you to one of my best friends and most interesting characters that I was allowed to meet yet. We'll go riding in Verbier and I'm curious about his new project he's been working on. participate the entire village and we asked all these people to bring a piece of fabric that represented their culture and we hand sewed everything and I like the idea that it all links towards the center where we all came from and where we all will go back eventually. train station and uh, my friend's bar. I just felt that wheel, that wheel of life that is turning, experience of the physical incarnation and there's a special entrance through that secret passage. This part of the Alps is a powerful place. Quite a few friends that I met traveling in the past call it their home. So now I've always drawn. I spend more time drawing on the side of my school books than actually reading them. <laughs> I did that one painting and I felt something was coming through me as 
some kind of inspiration that was coming from, from deeper, that was beyond me. I just felt a drive or something that I can let myself uh, drop into. had a magical flow. I saw his dedication to his art projects in a whole new way. But it was easy to see that he will never stop writing. It gives me satisfaction, but he doesn't give me as much satisfaction as these days where everything comes together. because you have to be connected with yourself, with the mountain, with nature. You can't lie, you have to be, to be connected because nature gives you the feedback directly, the slap in the face when you're not in the right position. Or you learn how to be more humble or, or ride more in connection with, uh, with the elements. It's all good. <laughs> Everything leads to the same point at the end. But I love the different ways to reach. 